Hello YouTube, welcome back to my life. I make videos weekly, so please subscribe if you want to come along for the ride. Today we're going to be talking about RMS Wild with Desire lipsticks. <laughs> so I have three shades here to share with you, and they're lip liner in daytime nude. So let's get started with the swatches and maybe I'll chat about it a little after. You know what, I'm going to put some concealer on because I just exfoliated my lips and they're looking a little rosy. <laughs> All right, so hopefully that go will show you more of a true color. All right, so that's the lip liner from RMS in Daytime Nude. I almost wanna call it kind of taupey, like it's a rosy brown, but I think the Nighttime Nude even has more of that rose and more of that brown. I really wanna get that one too. It is a um, twist up which is kind of nice. I usually prefer just the regular wooden kind, but it also has a little thing so you can sharpen it just in the bottom there, which I think is really handy. So we're gonna start with the lightest color. Seems to make sense, right? So if you haven't seen these before, they come in a metal tube, shows RMS like such. This is the shade Breathless, and it just looks like a beigey nude. Has a lot of yellow undertones. I don't know if you can see there, this is very nude. It's almost like Kate Moss when she is on those magazine covers and it's too nude, maybe? So I've been working with this one. I've been mixing it. I'm gonna try mixing it with different light pinks and things to try and neutralize it. I don't mind this color. I just think it looks nicer with more of a bronzy complexion and I'm kind of on the paler side right now. So that's what it looks like. And again, that shade is Breathless. Next, we're gonna be using the shade Brain Teaser. And this looks like a mid-tone mauve. Mauve. <laughs> Starting to speak like Americans. Do you say mauve or mauve? Where are you from? <laughs> it's the shade Brain Teaser. Again, very rosy brown. I feel like it just gives you like enough poutiness I think it even might have some orange undertones. It almost feels very fall appropriate. So this is the one I tend to reach for the most right now. Perfect, so we've got Brain Teaser on the bottom and Breathless on the top. Now I emailed RMS when they first released their Wild with Desire lipsticks. I don't know why I say it like that. <laughs> and I asked which ones contained artificial pigments because I was trying to be a purist and I still kind of err on that side of um, being safer and enjoying my products and they said those two out of the original line didn't have any artificial dyes so they were the first ones I picked up. Next one's my favorite. This does have um, a very small amount of food grade dyes as Rosemary Swift says. It is called Russian Roulette and it is just a gorgeous berry shade. I'm gonna do this first for you. One swipe. <laughs> so beautiful. <laughs> so I even like to just do this as a stain and pat it in. I'll try and show you. And roulette worn just like a stain, so you can do very light and rosy, and you just pat it on with your fingers, which I think is always a very pretty effect. And then we're gonna take it to the next level. Wish me luck, I don't have any lip liner. <laughs> All right, so that's a slightly less than perfect swatch of my favorite shade, Russian Roulette. And if you're gonna be wearing a brighter color like this, remember to keep it off your teeth do the pop. And my final thoughts on these, these are the closest to conventional lipsticks that I feel like I've tried in the natural beauty realm. And I love them. I don't feel like I have to compromise on anything. I always love a pretty package, so the package is a little sleek and modern for me, but that's okay. The formula is very long lasting. The colors are all beautiful and you can tell that a makeup artist uh, was involved in creating them because they're so flattering. And I think there's a great array. I hope she keeps releasing more. 
<laughs> and I highly recommend them. These are a lot more affordable than the Cure Weiss lipsticks. I'm actually just going to double check the price for you here. So these will run you $36 Canadian and $28 US and I can't recommend them enough. If you want any more swatches, if you have any questions, please leave it in the comments below. I'd be happy to help you out. Highly, highly, highly recommend. I think the best lipstick formula in Green Beauty right now. But do be aware if you are staying completely free of dyes, these do have food grade dyes in them. So maybe check out 100% Pure. Alright, thanks so much for watching. Till next time.